transformed herself into a magician's assistant. That could be scary. Yeah, I see that you're proud, but that could be scary. <laughs> Good morning, yeah. Camby. It could be scary. Good morning. I already gave the introduction, but let's just do it one more time. The award-winning magician, Ron Sailor. <laughs> how, how did I do? Uh, that was pretty good, yeah. Thank you. Can I be your assistant? I hope so, yes. Okay. Oh. All right. What trick are you going to do we, for us? We're going to start off something with a very special, silent, uh, quiet, but no less impressive. Take a look at this. Um, it's just simply a table. That's all it is. Uh, but it has a flying carpet on the top of it. That makes it strange. Uh, I'm going to just place my hands behind this. Don't take your eyes off of this for a second because you'll be amazed to see what... <gasps> That doesn't happen every day, does it? Whoa! All right, take a look underneath. I want you to see, uh, is there any jet packs, strings, no, nothing? No, this is not what I was expecting. He, do, he wouldn't <laughs> tell me what was going on with the trick. Here, let this me, is not what I was expecting. Let me lift this up for you so you can see there's nothing really holding this up. Layla, do you see anything? I don't see nothing anything, but how heavy is this it, thing, Camby? In fact, uh, actually, how I'll, heavy is this table? It, it's pretty heavy. In fact, there, oh, there's the mechanism right there. I just, yeah. All right, nice, whoa, wait, come back. Come back! <laughs> oh my gosh, how long did it take you to learn this trick? Well, you know, uh, some people fly kites. Um, <laughs> and I, you just fly tables. I fly tables. <laughs> I hey, if you want to see the award-winning <laughs> magician, Ron Saylor, up here, okay, he's going to magically appear at Hodel's on Saturday. What do people need to do if they want to come out and check you guys out? This is so fun. The, the Bakersfield Magic Circle does an annual benefit uh, show uh, it's at Hodel's this year, this Saturday. Um, the show's at 7.30, dinner starts at 6, and uh, bring the whole family. There's uh, food and show and just a whole, oh my gosh, hour plus of entertainment. And you, when they're eating dinner, you guys will actually be walking around doing some tricks. You can interact with the kids as well. Close up, uh, sleight of hand magic during dinner, and then uh, a large stage show, uh, nine magicians in all uh, at the event. So who, who seems more impressed with the tricks, the adults or the kids? <laughs> Magic is for all ages. Yeah. It's timeless. It really is. I was really impressed. I asked, I, I said, hey, well, what are you going to do? Because, you know, I wanted to know it for the tease lately. I said, well, what are you going to do? He said, well, I'm not going to tell you. It's a surprise. That is not what I was expecting. You know what I was expecting him to do? What? To pull the carpet and then just, like, leave the box right there. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, let, let me uh, go ahead and show you take a look at this because there is really nothing there but a table see Layla what do you think wow can you do that no no I could not I could not yeah, but I'm a neither. sucker for these things <laughs> I you know I'm always up me for good too. magic show I, I told him I said listen I'm like really easily impressed like <laughs> it like just finding the card I'm like how did you do that <laughs> All right, Cammy Brown, thank you so much. Let's not disappear too quickly over there, though. Poof, you appeared. I know. da -na! Actually, I made my magic wand disappear, too. So that oh. is gone right now. Uh, you guys, Chris didn't have an introduction. Because you know I did the one for Ron. So I need to come up with something good for Chris. Are mm. you ready for this? I'm ready. This is your new intro. All right. The handsome and talented, extremely fun magician! <laughs> Chris Lopez. I love that. Sounds a lot that like guy? the other oh, one. I love that. That is great. That's, yeah, yeah. I'm going to put that. I want to record that and put that in my shows now. You like the other one, John? Is that so what it you said? It sounds a lot like the other one. What? Oh, it does. Oh. <laughs> Chris is Sorry. like, what? They, Sorry, Chris. Yeah. yeah. Chris, so that His work name for is me. Chris. He, he said that it sounded a lot like the other one. Oh. It did. Okay. You're right. I'll work Maybe on something like different. Or something. Yeah. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There you go. Yep. I'll work on the dance. Okay. What magic trick are you going right, to do for us? We're going to do a classic trick. Uh, this is the, the the Chinese rings. Okay. okay. Uh, what we have is you see we have two rings right here, and all you have to do is clink them together like this, and you can see it's solid. Solid. Solid on solid. Clink them together just like this, and you can actually see blow. Just blow a little bit right there. Perfect. Good. They actually link right together just like so. You can actually what? see that. I know. It's impressive, That's isn't cool. it? That's <laughs> cool. Just like How this. How did he go do back. that? And you can see it unlinks just I like I didn't so. blow on it, though. You didn't blow on it? No. It just did it see, by itself? Yeah, just when they link, when they link together, that's, what, that's when you got to blow. I so thought blow. I had, like, One a special time, bad breath or yeah, something. Yeah, no, you got to see. There you go. See, and just links just like that. I mean, it's it's impressive, isn't it? Yeah, it's I'm just, impressed. Uh, like, you know. Are you going to do Next time I need a stapler, okay, Camby, you, you, you can check those, you know, those out. Check blow on the stack of papers. You What did you say, Next time I need a stapler, I'm just going to have you blow on the stack of papers. Apparently, that makes them, you know. That fastens them. It makes them attach, yes. Yeah, it, you know, check them out. You see we have one, two, three right here. I'll tell okay. you what, we'll even do this. Watch, with no hands, watch. You can see. Whoa! It's like clap on. It's like the clapper, yes. 
Yeah. They're all good. Watch, I'll tell you what. I'll take these three right here. Okay. You hold on to those two. I'll take these okay. three. Watch. Okay, guys, really quick, I got to tell you that this they are performing. Um, Ron and Chris and some other magicians are performing at Hodel's this Saturday night. Put the information on the screen. You can call that number or go to that website and get the information. Um, we're going to work on the dance for Chris for Chris oh. Lopez's introduction. All yeah. right, let's just groove it right now. Right, oh, right okay. We, oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, you're gonna need a little more than magic for that, Cambi. Uh, hey, by the way, Cambi, our producer just said the real magic trick here is you ending your live shot on time. <laughs> hey! <laughs> That's not funny. Oh, uh, we love you. We love it you. It is what it is. Abracadabra, make Cambi go away. I want to see some of the tricks she has learned. Cambi, I'm getting some uh, folks on Facebook wanting to know why you're not wearing a more traditional magician's assistant uniform. Oh, which typically well, it's are cold skimpy. outside. I was supposed to be outside with the grapes this morning, so I had to dress accordingly. I you know, so and sorry. Kind of, and kind of grape wear is not good for magician's assistant either. Yeah, They're sorry. Yeah. I okay. Um, what what were, what were they wanting me to wear? Well, magicians assistants say? usually wear not much clothing. Yeah, that's the point they were making. So, sorry about that, guys. This not appropriate. Not appropriate. <laughs> uh, okay, so I told you guys it was raining outside. Now you're gonna make it snow. Well, you know, the one thing that's nice about Bakersfield is that the weather is always changing. Right. <laughs> so here we go. Well, let me show you this. The water, okay. Is it, whoa, whoa, okay, I need Raining. to step back a little bit. <laughs> Getting splashed. Okay, what is, th what is this? A little tissue. Okay. Whoa, where'd it go? Wow. Well, I'm waiting for the snow. Oh, whoa! ta -da! That's impressive. <laughs> yeah. Are you? How long did it take you to learn this trick? This is amazing. A little snow in Bakersfield. <laughs> I actually thought for a second, Campia, when you brought out the water, that we were going to see a actual snow, snow like snowflakes. But that was still oh. impressive. Yeah, I know. That was amazing, right? Mm -hmm. Who's going to be cleaning Fantastic. this up at Hodel's? That's the other magic <laughs> <Me>? trick. <laughs> <laughs> who's going to make Who's going to make all this disappear? Uh, oh. I'm an, oh, am I uh, oh, yeah, I'm on to you. Show. I have to do the cleanup here. Uh, yeah, hey, this is all going to... can be cleaning up yeah. down there. <laughs> this is all happening at Hodel's on Saturday night. You can either call the number or go to the website on your screen to be able to come see this live in action. Are you going to be doing this trick on Saturday? I am not performing this piece of magic. I okay. have three other effects, including oh. uh, a classic full cut in half routine. Okay. Uh, I will be having a volunteer lay down. We will cut in half. Cut her in half. I will walk right through her. Oh my gosh! Now, also, a magician's assistant outfit. Do you have an assistant? I have four lovely ladies, and they're always dressed they appropriately. Appropriate. Very cute little costumes. Yes. Cute little costumes. All right, there you go, John. I think that's what folks were looking for. All right, Camby. Thank you very much. All right, Aaron, thanks. Time now is uh, 845. While Aaron was doing the weather, we were looking at a monitor off to the side here. Yes. Camby Brown. Uh, getting fitted for the guillotine. Yeah, and looking a little scared. Uh, still looking a little scared. Hey, good morning, Cammy. I am. I am scared, you guys. Um, first of all, I would like to tell you guys that today is my one-year anniversary. Yay. Oh, congratulations! Working in Bakersfield, and it might be my head. last day ever. <laughs> Your one-year anniversary here at the station, you mean, right? <laughs> Clapping really fast, like that. Yeah, one year working at the station. <laughs> It took LJ only one year to get me in the guillotine. He's very excited about this. I don't know Record if you can hear him. Us. Yeah, great. All right, uh, have you ever had any accidents with this before? You know what, luckily I have not had any accidents. So a few close calls, but no accidents. Mm, so okay. it, it's, it's pretty safe. All right, here we go. Yeah. Let's do so this. Chris, oh wait, we have to show them oh. your, new, your new intro. We oh, came up yeah, with a new, new intro. intro. That's right, here, right, we right, 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 right. here we go, here we go. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's his, synchronized. That's his, his head bob. What do you think? You yeah, like it? I, like I think it. Chris's head bob's better than yours. Pretty cool, right? Yeah. I like oh. it. Yeah, yeah, I like they it. Like Sorry, sure. they don't like my head bob. Head. Like head bob. All right, my head might be on the floor yeah. after this. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. You come on in. Okay. Just like that. Put your head right in there. Just okay. like that. All the way down. All the way down. All the way down. Am I doing good? You're doing excellent so far. Excellent. This could be yeah, a YouTube moment. Ow! Okay. Off with her head. Oh no! So you can't escape. Excellent. Good. 
All right. Okay. So, now there's nothing to be nervous about. Mm. Nothing to be nervous about. Here we go. Move your things back just a little bit because okay. I don't, I don't want to happens. Don't cut your knees off too. But oh. just Here we go. Ready? On the count of three. One, two, three. <laughs> Whoa. Am Whoa. I alive? How come it didn't fall? Did you feel anything? Am I alive? It, did you feel anything? No. Oh, good. That means we cut through the nerves. Excellent. Good, good, good. Nice. <laughs> so we'll take this right here and we'll bring this on up just like what that. What if her head just rolled off? Oh. And you're good. Oh, my gosh. Ta-da. Oh, yeah. Although you, oh, yeah, you did good. get me on the side oh, here. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no. That's, that's Am I bleeding? bleeding? Oh, no. You know, it's just a flesh wound. You're okay. okay. It's just a little scratch. <laughs> Thank goodness. All right. Are you going to be doing this trick on Saturday? Yes, that trick will be in, in the show. We're actually going to uh, have someone, a volunteer from the audience, come up and do that trick. Okay. This is on Saturday. Give people all the information okay. so they know. What we're having is we're having uh, nine magicians performing here at Hodel's. Uh, Hodel's have been very, very nice to us. And, uh, yeah, they gave they me have, free breakfast yes, this morning. I'm a that's fan. Great. They're <laughs> Bacon. Uh, we're having um, a buffet dinner. Along with your buffet dinner, you also get close-up magic by uh, four professional magicians, and then a professional stage show by five magicians, or six magicians, I'm sorry. Uh, we're going to be doing everything from cutting a person in half to the guillotine to okay, the... Okay, and really cabinet. quick, how much yeah. is this? It's 10 bucks if they just want to come to the show, and how much if they want uh, dinner and the If they the want magic. dinner, close-up magic and everything, it's uh, kids are 26 28 and $30 for adults. Okay, there you go. Yep. So uh, check it out on Saturday. Saturday. Yes, this guys. Saturday. All right, Camby. Good to know you're still alive, babe. Well, congratulations, keeping I your know. head. Yeah. Appreciate it. Thank that. you. <laughs>